Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, after reacting to SB19's What Music video, you guys suggested me in the comments quite a lot that I should watch through the episodes from 1 to 5th of the making film of music video What. There's like 5 episodes as I believe. I'm not quite sure what to expect there as there is like 5 episodes. The beat music video was very very intense. There were so many things going on. And you guys told me that there's like each episode is about something else. So, and I know this song is really important to them. And I would like to know deeply about the song as well. Not only like musically, but also lyrically. So, I mean, I'm really excited to see it. And I will probably not stop again. So grab a snack, grab a drink. And yeah, let's get right into it. Okay, okay, okay. What? What? So, dito sa kantang to, it's about parang raising your flag and being proud of yourself and loving yourself. So, kumbaga, pag hindi mo kasi minahal yung gawa mo, hindi mo minahal yung sarili mo, hindi lalabas yung tunay na potential or yung natatagong galing mo. Well, that's deep already. And you guys told me that about paano maging. Yun nga sinasabi ko kanina, paano maging proud sa sarili mo kahit ano pang status mo sa buhay, gaano man kaliit o kalaki. Nung napakinggan ko siya, nung nabasa ko yung lyrics, parang nagkaroon ako ng uh, mat mataas na pag-asa na maabot ko pa lalo yung mga gusto kong maabot sa buhay. Itong kanta na to, parang Ito na siguro yung mag-represent ko sino kami talaga. Dito na namin, papakilala ko sino kami. Kumbaga, yung, parang kung ano yung meaning ng kanta, yung sarili naming flag. Kasi yung kanta, di ba, about siya sa, parang kung sino ka man, maging proud ka sa sarili mo, may, may sarili kang bandera. And this time, ito yung kanta na magpapakita nun, yung individuality namin, and, and yung pagiging grupo namin. Ay, ito pala, hindi naman yung request na I mean, that shows their personality so well after I have watched all these interviews and doc episodes. Alam mo yung yung sasisa ng Blackface, yung gumagalong gumagalong ah, gumagalong. Ayun. Tapos may mga nakalutang na papel sa paligid mo, ah. ikaw lang yung gumagalong ng mabilis, yung papel nakastop. Ah, okay. Ah, parang, parang ano, tapos yung mga papel. Okay, they're talking about the visualization of the video. Ah, video. Tapos, kung pwede ano yun, pwede yun. 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 Iniisip mo ba yung parang gagalaw, yung camera na gagalaw? Ah, ah, robot yun eh. Ano? Robot yun eh. Nakaprogram ni mismo yung ano yun eh. <laughs> I mean, that was a sick shot in the music video. He walked in the paper, so just like. What? <laughs> I mean, cool that they're like adjusting the song even though it's like basically done. Gusto ko sa ending may maging happy yung feeling. Okay, 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 din sa ako sa ganun. Tapos dun sa last course nito, parang hindi na ba lang na, alam sa laman nyo nyo yan, Lord, banan, iwagay mo, tapos parang mag i-scat, tapos bigla magpapalit ng, ng vibe na parang happy na, okay. hip-hop-ish na, parang mabounce na na. Old school. Yes, yeah, but that's what I also got from the ending of the video, like, it was like, uplifting the video, like, standing up. Guys, ayun yung idea. Yun nga, alam mo na naman yun, mag-resive. Talaga gusto natin yung parang kikilabot na talaga sila, di ba? So, umpisa pa nga lang yung tunog pala, nakakilabot na yung trumpet. Yung sinor pa kasi to, parang I was thinking more of people in general. Siguro, I was also talking about SB19 as a group, kung ano yung music namin or kung ano kami. Kasi in the previous releases namin, yung mga nag-compose is Korean. No kanta so ang ang kyan tribute ng namin is yung lyrics so and minor changes sa mga melodies this time um 
mas nag-contribute or solely SB19 yung nag-contribute sa paggawa ng kanta. And I think, and I believe na um, kumbaga na ipasa namin o na ilagay namin yung song namin dito as a person, not just a Filipino. Yeah. It's cool to see the song like in production process how it's like mixed together. I mean, for demo recording. Number two, demo second demo. And I know Isa busy max cellphone. Next is Elbon. Puro sa Elbon. Puro sa Elbon. Puro sa Elbon. Oh, ganda. Oh, ganda nun. Very, ano, enchanted. Pare-parehas lang tayo may pagkakaiba. Diba? Ikaw nila, ibang mundo na. I mean, it's so cool to see them, like, creating this piece. I'm excited. I can imagine that it's different. It's like this, it's so big. And then, when we get to the part, it's so big. And then, it's like... Oh my God! Bumalik ako dun sa pinanggalingan, sa roots namin. So, uh, most, uh, yung mga kanta talaga, parang connected and parang pinapoint out talaga nila na may pinanggalingan kami. And eto kami. Tapos, dun na nagsimula yung parang, what, ano ba yun? Ano ba yun? Nagsim, ano ba yung pinagmula natin? Yeah, the roots. Di na magpapapaawat. Ay, napalimit na ako. Di na magpapa, paawat, iwawag ay wayang watawat. Oo, oo, oo. Iwawawin. Ah, ikaw ba? I-record natin mo yun. Ayan lang. Actually, lahat dapat yun. So, oo, oo, oo. Di na magpapa, what? Tapos ano pa? Kapat natin siya. Maniwala, darating ang mga biyaya, higit pa sa lahat-lahat ng nawala. I mean, it's so interesting to see all of this. Darating ang mga biyaya, higit pa sa lahat-lahat ng nawala. Hey! Yay! Every time na nagre-record naman kami, lahat kong ina-enjoy yung moment na nasa loob ako ng recording studio na pag ako na yung nasa harap ng mic, sobrang ina-enjoy ko lang yung moment na yun na nandun ako. Pero this time kasi siguro nagdagdag lang ako ng konting, ah, Ibang attitude ni Stel, parang gano'n. Kasi yung kanta namin, parang palaban eh. Kumpara dun sa mga kanta namin before na Go Up, Alab. So parang sa recording namin, sa mga recording practices namin, talagang nilalagyan ko ng konting angas yung iniisip yeah, ko. Yeah, you need to have to be, ako, to have confidence to so, like tell me your vocals. Ko, kahit hindi pa sa MV, kahit sa boses ko pa lang, parang maportray ko na yung character na gusto kong ilabas para sa kanta na to. Yun. Honestly, ako talaga. Dahil gano'n ako. Kung baga... Tinay... May hindi ko mas namin tinay. Mas namin tinay talaga. Pero totally hindi gano'n kasi kapos din sa time. Pero tinatry ko magsingit ng practice time for myself din talaga. To improve yung mga naglalak ako na bagay. So, ayan. Ayun yung mga isa sa mga pinaka-finocus ko. Na globalization. Ako gano'n mag-isa kahit na sa bahay na ako at the same time. Tsaka parang sinapuso ko rin talaga itong kanta na ito. Ako, um, very nervous ako. Hindi ko alam bakit, pero kahit na ako yung simulat ng kanta, kahit ako yung nag-compose, parang feeling ko bago, bago pa rin sa akin ng kanta. I mean, you're building it from scratch. Um, gustong gusto kong maganda yung kalabasan, kaya 
Uh, and it did. It turned out good. At the same time, sobrang excited ako at um, masayang masaya kasi uh, sa wakas makapaglabas kami na kanta na kami yung magpapulse, kami yung gagawa, um, kami yung kami yung sumulat or kami yung gumawa. Yeah, like they did it. Talagang SB90. Siguro, kasi ako, lagi ko rin ito sinasabi sa members na I want them to be proud of themselves. I want them to They're all so good. Uh, step up, you know, to be proud of what they do. Kasi if hindi mo mahal yung ginagawa mo or hindi mo mahal yung sarili mo, hindi magpo-project yung the best you. So, ako, as much as possible, at palagi kong pinapaalala na uh, sa mga kapo. Like, bringing each other up, like, it's so important in group settings. Uh, though, parang, in this industry, uh, general. Ir- ironic, kasi ako, mahilig ako eh. Mahilig kong igawin sa sarili ko. Parang uh, laki ako. Um, I mean, lagi akong may self-hate, parang gano'n. That's what we do as humans here, self. Hindi pa enough yung ginagawa ko. Biggest critics of ourselves. Pero yun, parang gusto ko sana sa ibang tao ma-push sila na parang maging proud sila para naman ma-ibas nila yung potential nila. Raise your own flag. Be proud and love yourself. You guys, this was really interesting to see. That's what I, when I was watching the making of Genta, I was like, I would love to see like, behind behind the scenes of how this is working out and this is so cool to see how they are like literally building the song even though like the main part is done how they're like how they're adding ad-libs how they're changing their like vocals how they're recording the vocals how they are preparing themselves to sing that what they are experiencing each one of them in a, each segment of the song and and the Pablo at the end was like yeah like embracing each other and pushing them out and being proud of themselves and loving themselves and and like he said also about like like he brings it he tries to bring it on up but he's the one he brings himself down but like we as people we are the biggest critiques of ourselves like no one else is critiquing themselves as yourself you know so i mean that's a, a quite a good point to point out there like i can relate that to myself as well because i'm usually like no you can do this do that that did this and to myself I'm like you can do this better you can do that better but like it's also like to in healthy boundaries it's kind of a good thing so you involve but if you like cross that line and you're just talking like bad about yourself you're just starting to believe of that over time but it's good that they have each other and they can bounce off each other's energies and bring each other up and they're all really empathic and just... They have good souls. They have come from different places and they know the difficult things and they know how to make them good and how to make people good around them. So, yeah, I mean, I love this episode. I'm not sure how it's gonna go with like this old music going out throughout the whole episode if I will need to cut some things out. I hope not. Because that would be such a shame, because I would love to just publish the whole thing as it is. That's why I don't want to stop in these episodes, I just want to soak them in and watch them with you and learn about them. And this is how we, I mean, at least I am, I don't know about you, but like, I am learning about them as I watch this. So, first episode done of the making film of the what, so four more to go, I believe, so... Yeah, I mean, I hope you enjoyed this video. I mean, what I didn't ask you, like, what, how, what did you thought of this episode, like, type of setting of them releasing episodes of making of the music video and just song in general of before the release or after release? I don't know that time framing how this came out before music video or after. I'm sure it was after. That would make more sense after people have seen the music video. Anyways, what did you thought of it? And because I. I really, really enjoyed it, and that being said, I will see you with episode two. Bye!